How you doing guys? This is Raj from Android Catboy um, and today I wanted to uh, speak to you guys a little bit about uh, the effects of rooting. You know, uh, I get a lot of uh, emails from people asking me you know, when I root, what happens with my apps, uh, updating and things like that. So I just want to briefly, uh, quickly go over that. So the first question usually I get is, um, you know, once I root a device, will I still be able to take updates from Amazon if, if there's a new update? And the answer is yes, you still will be able to take updates and the updates, um, you will also still be able to take them automatic as normal. Now, so that's fine, no issues with that. Then the second question is if, if I do take that update, do I lose root? Now, usually when you do update, if, if you've rooted it, you will lose root, okay? Uh, but that will remove any of the apps. So if you've installed the Google Play Store uh, after rooting it, that will still stay on there and you'll still be able to use that. But there's actually a way to try to uh, make sure that if you update that you will still maintain root. And and the way you can do that is um, uh, once you're rooted, there's an app that's on, that will be on your device called Super User. It's kind of the green looking Android um, guy face that's that's uh, app that's on there. So if you go into that and go into the settings, there's actually a check mark that says OTA Root Keeper, over the air root keeper. So if you check that, then that will uh, then the super user app will try to maintain that root uh, even after an update. So that usually works most of the time, but sometimes it doesn't. And if it does, you may have to reroute the device again, which, you know, it's, it's, it's a little bit of a pain, but, but rooting Kingdom Fire is fairly easy. And once you've done it, it'll, usually it's the same process, so it'll be real quick. The second question I get is usually uh, regarding, um, you know, apps. What happens with apps? Uh, can they automatically be updated? You know, Amazon apps versus Google Play Store apps. So that's the main issue. So once you've installed, once you've rooted and you put the Google Play Store uh, on there, then uh, you can download apps from the Google Play Store and you and you can automatically update them. But uh, one thing you do have to be careful is that there's a lot of apps that overlap both on Amazon and Play Store. And what you want to do is just make sure that you update from wherever you got the app originally because if for example, if you had downloaded a, a Netflix app from Amazon, when you install the Google Play Store, it will recognize that and say, ask you to update it to the Play Store. Now, if you do that, it'll be fine. It'll update, but then you lose that app um, association with Amazon. So what you want to do is keep them separate. So I would suggest that if you've installed the Play Store, you go in to settings and disable the automatic update because since there's a lot of uh, apps that overlap, uh, and if you have that setting on, then the Play Store... Uh, will actually automatically update, uh, for example, an Amazon app uh, to the Play Store. So you, you don't want to do that. So disable the auto updates. And once you disable the auto updates, then when you install apps, you'll have to periodically go in uh, into the Play Store, for example, and see if there's an update and manually do that yourself. And just make sure that when you're updating, you're updating an app that you downloaded from the Play Store, not from the Amazon. And in the Amazon section, you can still take updates there as well. So Updating the apps are no issues. You just got to make sure you keep them separate and you're updating them through the, the store that which you got it from. So if you got it from an Amazon store, then, then you update from there. If you got it from the Play Store, then you update from there. So that's the that's probably the two main things uh, about rooting, and, and it's a fact that you definitely want to um, um, know about. Um, and so this is, I think uh, hopefully this will this will help you guys and um, if you have any further questions you know feel free to contact me through the website uh, have a contact uh, link there you can send me an email um, or go on the Google Plus community page or, or leave a comment on any of the uh, articles as well I hope you guys enjoyed this video and it gives you some good information so subscribe to our channel um, and uh, give, this, give this video a thumbs up if you like it thank you